This is my Piranha 1 fish finder and depth finder. That right there is where you plug the transducer cable into and it runs off of double-A batteries that go into the back part right here. We're gonna take the kayak out on the lake today and see how it does. All right, so we got the kayak out on the lake today and I can say it is way more stable than my uh, John boat is. And so I think this is gonna be a real good candidate to make a ultimate river fishing kayak. So I went ahead and added a 14 inch light bar from Harbor Freight on here with the wiring harness from Harbor Freight. Just plugs into the light and then plugs into the battery and you put a switch on that also comes with the wiring harness. Y'all can get that all at Harbor Freight. Easy to install. Just testing out the light bar here and it is working perfectly fine. Nice and bright even when it's not that dark outside at the moment. So I went ahead and put some rock lights from Harbor Freight on also. You just uh, attach it to the switch, put the ground to the ground, positive to positive. Just make sure you don't put it to the wire that's always hot. Only the one that's hot after you turn the switch on. You'll be good to go. Now I just drilled a hole in it to put the wires through, screwed it to the side of the kayak, and then sealed it with some caulking. Now I welded together a simple frame out of scrap metal to put a uh, task light on from Walmart made by HyperTuff. Now this is the finished product with the kayak all lit up and going. And I think it's ready for the river. I'll give y'all a video in about a month or two when it gets warmer of it out on the river.